Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Nuclear Throne Ultra. We are going to jump in again and this time we are going to play as another new character. Who should we go as this time? Let's do... Immune to Toxic and Toxic Gas. Frog could be pretty fun. I know Frog isn't technically a modded character. Um, it is a vanilla character, but still, I haven't played Frog in forever. I think Frog also, like, always moves or something. Like, Frog can't stop moving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, as, as Frog, we... Uh, are always going to be moving. As you can see, I'm not pressing anything right now. So, we do have to kind of fight against the tides a little bit. Um, okay. We can, like... Mm. Okay, so the poison ability is pretty goddamn good. Also, I'm guessing this makes poison weapons really goddamn strong as this character. Okay, I like it. Um, what we're going to go for? Trigger fingers, maybe? I wonder, like, how much I can charge this up. Damn. Also, the weapon that we start with is very, very good by the looks of it. It seems really good. We'll pop that. Nice. Dude, this Toxic is amazing. This character is kind of amazing. Let me see if I can grab another gun real quick here. Shotgun, thank you. And then anything else we can do here? To be fair, we can, we can kind of spam poison as we go as well if we want to. I suppose there's a way for us to stop as well. Dude, that's amazing. Does it, like, go in the direction that I point? It, it kind of does. It's not, like, super directional. But it does kind of go in the direction that I point it in. But this is... This seems like a really, really strong character right now. Like, look at the damage that that does. Boom, bow. Amazing. Obviously, always having to move is the big downside here, I'm guessing, but it seems pretty good so far. We'll take Absorbing Pause. It's early enough to make that worthwhile. But yeah, whenever there's like a cluster of enemies, firing off a, boat, a boatload of poison towards them seems like the way to go here. Okay, I did get hit there. That was a little bit of a dumb hit by me. You can just kind of spam the hell out of it as well. It's, it's just kind of crazy, this. I'm liking it a lot. i got to say, I'm liking it a lot. Also, the amount of rads and stuff we're getting right now is pretty ludicrous. Ooh, this got buffed up to 30% damage as well, which is nice. Um, Yeah, let's go for it. Okay. Just clear out swaths of enemies in one go. Oh god, he's on top of me. I did not want him on top of me. Oh no! My bad. I didn't realise there was a thingy there, mine. My bad, but this is... This is really good. You know what, actually, let's quickly, um... Let's quickly just kill ourselves a bit here. Eh. Oh god damn it. It's so hard to kill yourself on these dudes. Gimme, give gimme. Give eh. God damn it. Let me die! Why won't you let me die? There you go. One more. There you go. I just want to go back to the main menu real quick. Uh, because I want to see what our uh, alternate skins require us to do. So we've got use two different toxic weapons in the same run. Okay, we can do that. Reach and beat the throne as frog on the game mode disc room with the setting at least six discs. What the hell? Okay, we'll at least go for the B skin. We can definitely get the B skin, but C skin seems a little convoluted. Some of that in there. Dude, the, the fact that our starting weapon's this good is insane as well. The starting weapon's absolutely ludicrous. I love it. What a great way to start as a character like this. Uh, throw and butt. Toxic spreads faster, it lasts longer, homing toxic, active spawns toxic towards your aim. Okay. That seems amazing. Oh my god, it hurt. It homing is insanity. This is... This... This is absolutely insane. Like... No, 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 I don't want to go in there yet. Oh, my God. Bit of a waste there. I could just do this. My goodness. 
We've got an inverted portal over here as well. Lovely stuff. Oh, I didn't even get the goddamn thing there. Um, we'll take turtle shell. Ooh, the inverted area. This looks awesome. Cool. Taken care of. I mean, just holding it for a short amount of time. I love the noise I make. Look at that. Oh my god. Right, just throw a bunch of poison over that way. We've opened up the throne vault. No, 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 not yet. Don't want to go in there yet. We've got a big old weapon chest here. I guess I'll take that for now. My good god, this is kind of insane. Um, extra feet seems really good with this. Fast, Faster movement on a character that doesn't stop moving. Also, I've been told there's a bunch of secrets to do with all the different various um, crowns that I need to get involved with soon. So I'm going to take a look at that. Oh, don't some of the enemies down here do poison as their attacks? Makes us immune to all of that. Oh, God. Dude. The shark boss is so overtuned, in my opinion. <laughs> Every time I go down there, he just destroys me. Why do we get the boss already? What's that about? I'll never know. Is it because I like opened up all the chests really quick or something? Yes, it was. Okay. I should be firing while I'm doing this, really. That's something that I've been doing that's a bit stupid. Okay. Um, go with that. Oh, so we can go straight down to the water area by doing that. Kind of interesting. I definitely throw in butt again. Definitely need a good old bit of throne, but again. But yeah, I can speed down to this area, which is kind of interesting. But yeah, I want to go to the inverted area of this again. This was kind of amazing. Uh, give me that real quick. Lovely. Where's this going to take us now, then? Okay, so straight to here, and we're going to have to fight the fish boss again. Yeah. So let's try and take everything out before we take out fish boss, because... He's been notoriously difficult for us so far. Honestly, don't really want to have to deal with him. Oh, dude, the bouncer shots are tricky. He sucks me up. I don't want to be sucked, boy. Don't suck me. Don't blow on me, son. Okay. This should do it. No, no, no. Don't suck on me. Dude. Okay, I got him. I got him. Oh. Guy's really tricky. <laughs> Is that, not, is that not it? Oh, there's a fish left. Okay. There's a few fish left. He left loads of these boys about. What the hell? Okay. We've got some good stuff going there. Um, plutonium hunger, I think. I, I always find it funny the, uh, the way that you go from under the ocean to in a volcano. Like, I suppose technically there's a lot of volcanoes underwater. Or they originate underwater at least. So it kind of makes sense. But only just. I suppose the later you get into the game, the less the toxic like becomes valuable. But it does do a good bit of damage just like around the area. Hammerhead will take. It's like a good way to sort of weaken enemies up. I think that plus scarier face is a good way to make a decent dent. Okay, careful. We've not had to switch weapon at all yet. We've not really had any better weapons so far. Pick out you for a hot second. Okay. Having a lot of a hard time. One of the hardest things about this character is not getting too over-reliant on the poison. At the minute, I feel like I'm maybe using the poison too much and it's causing me problems. We're at the throne vault. Not particularly happy with my current HP right now. It's not ideal. Thank you, Hammerhead. What is going on up here? 
Oh god, melee's not good with this character. Not being able to stop to melee is uh, unfortunate. Is this the boss fight? Blade gun? Blade, blade gun can't hurt me, can it? No, it can't, okay. Why is there a fire spewer in the middle of this boss fight? <laughs> That's tricky. Makes things a lot harder for me. There's our throne, but... The fact that it herms once you get the throne, but... Makes it insane. Laser rifle will take over the base weapon now, I think, at this point. Yeah, boy, I like that. Okay. Think we're, think we're all set right now. Frost flat cannon, hell yeah. Anything frost is good. Ow. Oh, dude. These enemies are so tricky. Good, good, good. We got through it. We got through it. Oh, that's the end of the stage. One second. Now let's keep this rolling. Oh, God, yeah. A little bit sketchy. Aha! You spawn on me. I don't I don't think so, buddy. Oh god, it's Cheshire Cat. Dude, these bosses that just like sit on my face are really causing me some grief. There's gotta be it, right? No, it's still not it. How are you not dead yet? How are you not dead yet? Okay, there you go, finally. Oh my god, that was tricky. Use my frost boy. Freeze you into pieces. Heavy blood shotgun sounds fun too. Um, honestly, alien intestines sounds like really good with this. Yeah. Heavy blood shotgun seems good to me. Bloodline as well. The line weapons are really good for just keeping your distance from things, so... Big into that. Okay, stay away from the angry doggies. Angry doggies ain't my business. Good old bit of poison. Blood bubble. There's so many blood weapons at the minute. What's going on with all the blood weapons? I see you back there. Okay, is this boss time now? I think this is boss time now. Um, I'm not sure what to take here, to be honest. Strong spirit, I guess, is good. We've got lightning or frost. I guess we take frost on this, maybe? And we go for the boss. And we see what's what. Heavy Toxic Launcher. Okay. We'll take the Heavy Toxic Launcher because we finally got a toxic weapon now. I thought it was going on my camera, I'll be honest. No idea. Okay. Let's try the Heavy Toxic Launcher. Okay, it's doing a good amount of damage so far. Gotta not not be able to stand still on this is also really awkward. Okay, we got into loop though, that's nice. Good old loop. Um and then what do we take? Alkaline saliva maybe? Okay. Okay, this isn't really great for this guy. Let's use the bloodline. Yeah, blood bloodline's gonna be probably our, our main go-to here. I, do, I have just realized we're using two things of the same ammo type at the minute, though, which isn't ideal. So maybe swap this out for something. Lightning rifle is not the same ammo. Good. 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 
If only this thing broke through walls, then it'd be tippity top tier. Is that it for the first stage? Wow, that was a very, very empty first stage. I'm curious to see what this guy's uh, ultra ends up looking like. Yeah, this thing, this thing's good shit. This thing's real good shit. Okay, good. It destroys the truck real fast as well. Destroys projectiles coming in. Go through here, why not? There's my ultra. Right, what we got going on here? The bouncer plasma cannon sounds fun, although it is cursed, but never stopped me before. Right, so we got... Rads emit toxic gas, sounds good. Continuously emit gas, emit gas quicker using your active. Um, active creates friendly ball guys. Don't know what the hell that means. Um, normal controls while uh, in combat slowly consume gas to heal. I'm gonna go with Rads emit gas. Okay. This was a good decision. I just go around the corner and everything's dead. Okay. This is amazing. <laughs> this is real good. Like, the chain reaction of everything here is quite honestly insanely nutty. I want to see what this does. Double sl sided blade. For a tier 13, it seems pretty basic, but might have something more crazy going on. I don't know. That seems really good. Okay, through we go. And everything begins to die. Okay, take out Fish Boy before it becomes a problem. The truck almost got me. That was close. Energy Scythe. That sounds fun. Toxic Dragon. Damn it. We need uh, two toxic weapons to get B-Skin. I've already thrown one of them away. Hell. Hell's Bells. Okay, one second. Right, we continue onwards. But yeah, this, this whole rads emitting gas thing is pretty awesome. Also, this thing being frost is really nice too. I think it's I think it's also like being as good as it is because I have thrown but because with thrown but all the toxic is herming, so it's just become even better than it was otherwise. Beautiful. Is that it? That's it. Okay, cool. But basically, I've just, I've just got to kill a few things and then all hell breaks loose. Unfortunately, in areas like this where it's all closed off, it's a little bit harder. Use my ability there just to close that down. I need some healing game. Uh, to be fair, I'm getting healing from the rads I pick up, right? Oh no, I don't think I have that anymore. Ah, but I should just check that weapon chest. Ooh, to put toxic on my line weapon? Why not? Why not? Right, quickly before I do anything here, we need to go back over this way. And is it in here? Yes, it is. Okay, so we gain max HP here. We gain... Increase the uh, value of radiation by 15% here. And we gain an extra life on our next boss kill, so we can try and do that. But anyways. Let's head on out. But yeah, there's a few different crowns we need to take eventually. I've not really had a look through them properly yet, but we've got the Purity, Life, Death, Haste, Guns, Hatred. There's a few modded ones down here as well, I think. But either way, we're going to leave it bare for now, and we'll get to that later. Ow. Good thing about this is it just destroys shots, so... Uh, happy to keep using this. Dragon, you okay? 
Okay, dragon is dead. Pooey, this is a good run. This is a good run. Ow. Well, it's got them big blocks they keep leaving behind. I don't know why enemies leave that behind. I think they're like powered up versions of certain enemies or something. I think sometimes you can run into like an enemy that's been kind of overpowered. Super lightning crossbow. Nah, I think the bounce is still better. Beautiful. We have to fight Cheshire Cat again here in a sec. I think Treasure Cat's on this stage, right? Beautiful. Auto flat cannon. Some crazy stuff here. Beautiful, beautiful reds. Yeah, just this thing destroying shots is just immense. Yeah, through here again for another upgrade. Uh, radiation. Um, yeah, put radiation on it too. Why not? Why not? Oh, here's Cheshire Cat. Oh, God. No, 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 no. We've got Hammerhead. We've got Hammerhead. Get on through the walls. This is terrible. This is terrible. Just keep swimming. Oh, my God. I don't know how the hell I'm alive right now. Dude, Cheshire Cat is wrecking me right now. God damn. That was, tr that was tricky. It was really tricky, but we got through it. Right. Unfortunately, on this stage now, with the health of the enemies, the rads aren't just insta-killing everything anymore. That only happens on the early stages, apparently. Which is understandable and fine, but also sad. Warm bomb. Oopsie. Kind of missed with that. Beautiful. Okay. Is it boss time yet? No, not quite, not quite, not quite. Okay, big boy got a hold on me there. Big boy got a hold on me, but... Able to decimate through everyone. <gasps> Healing. I like it. I don't use too much of this ammo. Okay, actually, it's fine. Infinite slugger? Oh, goddamn. Right. We are through. Splinter, flame. I guess I'll go with flame on this. Right. Heavy toxic launcher. Is that the same thing we got last time? Pretty sure it is. Right. Let's take on the boss once more. Shouldn't have too hard of a time with it, I wouldn't think. That was the wrong weapon to use there. Whoops. Come on. What are you doing, Throne? There you go. Wasted some ammo on you, but there you go. Okay. The square bullets cannot be destroyed. Good to know. We should be almost done with the kill here. There you go. Cool. Why was melting? Why why is melting here shooting things? Did this, did this happen last time? I think it did, didn't it? Yeah, so having having shots that can't be destroyed is probably a good idea with this game. With this mod shot, I say. Okay. Amazing. Right. So we should be in the in the point now where things pretty much kill themselves again with all the radiation. Not on a Friday. Oh, we're level 11 now. I always forget that happens on this. Oh, what the hell?
Also a blood cannon, blood launcher even. Oh wait, what? Did that chest open or not? What happened there? Um, I don't know what to go for here to be honest. Higher max ammo is probably a good idea. Super penetrator, that's, um, that's something that exists. Higher max ammo just seems like a good way for us to keep being able to use this weapon. Yeah, a few of these guys. Don't get run over. Okay, a few of the inverted guys are about... We are losing out on a lot of our uh, ammo and stuff because everything's dying before we get to it. Sheep on a stick. Confusing, to say the least. Confusing. Right. Keep pushing forward. The maggots can't just keep appearing behind me here. Be careful. Okay, there you go. We got through that. Oh my god, I keep forgetting there's more trucks. There's always two trucks. One, one extra pair loop. We get the flame axe. Some really interesting weapons that you start getting on loops. I kind of wish some of these would show up earlier, but obviously I'm guessing they're balanced like that because they're just really strong. Oh my god, this guy. Calm it. Dude! I think their poison can hurt me, you know. These little maggot thrower dudes, you gotta keep your distance from them. They're kind of crazy. We've got here explosive morpho rear there. Okay. Okay, good. We unlock some golden weapons and stuff there. That's what I'm wanting to do at the minute. My main my main goal right now. Whoa! Hello. What is this? Oh, okay, it's just turning this area into that, okay. Luckily, Mum um, does a lot of poison, and we don't really care. Okay, just keep on shooting. Think we're okay here. I think we got her. There is a lot and a lot of uh, poison frogs about. Doing their thing. That is going to be the only unfortunate thing. If there's ever frogs about, we're going to poison them very, very quickly. Kraken grenade launcher. Explosive morpher ray. Hyper grenade launcher. Lots of explosive stuff. Scythe gun. Interesting. Okay, I almost died testing out weapons here. Let's uh, give myself this back. Dude. Oh my god. So foolish. So foolish. I'm just like testing out weapons and getting myself killed, but no, I was gonna say we'll leave it there. Do you know what? No, we won't, because we got a gold weapon now. This this character, I I honestly I don't know. I can't really see myself taking anything other than that ultra. That ultra is so goddamn good. Honestly, as well, golden weapons aren't as good on this character because the the, the base weapon you start with is so goddamn good. I mean, it's still good to have golden weapons and have that variety. Oh my god, stop moving backwards! <laughs> this poison's pathetic compared to what I'm used to. Beautiful. Um... Go power craving early on. Power craving is good for extra weapon mod slots. For mod choices as well. Yeah, I don't care much for you, good good boy. I don't care much for you at all. Big old bandita. Wrong direction. 
is actually also something I'll take, although less usable. I'm looking for, uh, what's it called? Bolt Marrow. Alkaline Saliva saved us a bunch of times previously, so I'll take that. Stop moving in the wrong direction, boy. Get poisoned. <laughs> I don't know if poison frogs produce more rads, because they are harder enemies. I, I wouldn't think they would, but there's a chance. Oh, right, wait. The wrong direction produces heavy crossbow shots. I did not know that. That makes it far more valuable. Level 4, lovely. Level 4 is very nice. Okay. And last weapon here, Frost Pistol. No thanks. Come on, game. Give me what I need. Does Eagle Eyes work with wrong direction? It does. Interestingly enough, it does. So now it's more of a um, wish shot vibe from Isaac than it is just completely the wrong directions. Which is going to make it better with Bolt Marrow, I think. If you try to steal stuff from me, I'll poison your ass. Don't try me. Don't try me a river. Oh, dude. When my guy is, like, just pulling in the wrong direction, I can't do anything about it. It's so frustrating. One of the major downsides of this guy. Okay. Double machine gun. Yeah, okay, we definitely got more rads from that frog. Uh, from the other frog than we did from that frog. So, I think it does actually produce increase the amount of rads they produce. Very good to know. Level 5 now. Check up here, real quick. Okay, there's nothing up here. Nothing around that area. But yeah, I like the idea of using wrong direction on bosses and stuff here, because uh, it's going to be a lot easier to hit this bad boy. Stay away from me, big boy. And you, big boy. Big boy number two. Through we go. Bolt marrow, finally. And we get... Explosive on this bad boy. This will also make uh, our wrong direction even better, I think. Some of them out the way. Explosive's pretty nice for destroying rocks and stuff. Destroying pieces of wall. How thick is wall? I'm not using my poison too much right now, but with this setup, I don't really feel the need. Yeah, that's it's pretty incredible. Frost Assault Rifle. Very, very nice. I'm going to stick with this because I've put some weapon mods on it now. But, decent. We can go Dragon if we want. I'm not really enthused about that at the moment. Where is the last enemy? Is it a fucking crow that's flown over my head? Yes, it is. God, it's always a goddamn crow. Okay, we're through here. We can go to another area here by giving up one of our weapon mods. I might do that, to be honest, because I haven't done that much before, and I'm sure there's some intriguing stuff over that way. Oh, stop pulling me the wrong way. Okay, we've got a weapon thingy here. Not weapon, sorry. Uh, overheal chest. Yes, I can sacrifice my weapon mods there. Let's let's try and actually get through the floor first. See if there's much else to see. Okay, good. Yeah, let's let's do that. I know explosive is good, but I just want to see what this like. I've not really been through here before much. Um, let's take ridge. Okay, this is actually good because this is an area. Heavily focused on poison. And poison really doesn't do much to us, so... This helps. It's probably the, the one character you want to go to this area with as much as possible. Oh, this thing has splinter on it too. I forgot that when we pick stuff up it gains uh, a bonus. So these guys literally can't damage me, right? Sword gun. Interesting. Um, 
Puffy Cheeks is kind of good here. I'm going to take Back Muscle just because of what we're using there. What, what does this do again? Is this, is, oh no, that's not the, the same thing. I thought that flower was the one you could use to go somewhere, but I think that's normally how you get here, isn't it? Cool. Super Hot Revolver. I don't know what Super Hot Revolver does. Does it just, like, bullets don't move unless you do, but I'm always moving so it doesn't work? Maybe. That's pretty fucking incredible. Wait, does that... That uses the same ammo type as well. Hmm. Yeah, let's take that. Let's try that out. That seems really good. It uses, um, thingy ammo so it might have herming. Yeah, it does have homing. Nice. Okay, this is this is awesome. I like this. Okay, we've got Hedge Boss here. Excuse me? <laughs> okay. Um, I knew he was there, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't have expected him to literally instantly pounce on me. Either way, that was a really fun run. We'll leave it there, um, and we'll try out maybe, like, the Weaponsmith on the next run. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.